Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to add a teleport NPC to your server. It's pre-made. It, it's pretty good. I like it. It has a lot of features in it. So yeah. Okay, the first thing you have to do is like um, go to WoWV. Well, the first thing you have to do is download it. Download it right here. The link will be in the description of the video. Yeah, so just download it. I already have mine right here. And now, now that it's there, just save it to your desktop or somewhere. Go to wowv.com. Log in or make an account and go to the mob slash NPC. Name it whatever you want. It's going to make a teleporter. Sub name. War wow. Server name. Something like that. Rank. Just leave it entry make sure it's 600,001 so it's 600001 display ID just look anything I'm just gonna put glitch king just get this right here copy it paste it you only need A not B or C or D Faction neutral type just put humanoid family put no family civilian just put just put yes boss put no model size just put one leave all this right here respawn well who cares just leave that you're not gonna really need that armor makes it really high so no one can kill him and health too and the mana this needs to be really high too so he doesn't run out when he's buffing or doing some stuff just make level anything you want damage make sure it's pretty high so no one attacks it just in case speed just put one holy just put anything you don't really need to fill this stuff out but yeah okay got just put just leave this like like right here you could just ignore this right here then click on submit and just wait you're gonna then um yeah it looks pretty good right now now just click download sql batch file download batch for archimu save it and like open it i guess You need to have my my SQL up so in order so you can log into your database and just import it into um into the Archimu or the world database right here. Just go to Archimu or it's usually world for you guys or if you're using AC web it's Archimu. Then go to the query and just hit F9. Okay, well, I had to pause the video for a little while. My phone was ringing. Okay, now the the teleport NPC, the Lua file that you downloaded, you're gonna want to open it with Notepad. Um, you should see in the first line it says no local NPC ID, like six hundred thousand one. Make sure it's six hundred thousand one. Now scroll all the way to the bottom and find. Yours should say NPC ID for both of these right here, and put six hundred thousand one the same the same um, ID as your as your NPC teleporter. Okay, now you're gonna want to scroll up until you find um, like Alliance Mall or Hordy Mall. Um, right here, I'm gonna show you how to edit the locations. Okay, what you're gonna need to do is open up well open up WoW and go to the place where your malls are located and like do a dot GPS command on it and like wherever you want them to go. Like there should be some coordinates like map and Z position and X and Y position, all that stuff. The map is gonna be the map ID right here. Mine was zero so I just left it at zero for right here this is gonna be the X position 
so you're gonna want to fill out the x position I'm just gonna put any random numbers and right here should be the y position don't erase any any commas or stuff like this spaces parentheses don't erase anything like that or it'll mess up the whole script okay now just do it again again I'm just doing I'm just doing these random numbers but make sure you get the exact coordinates and now for the hoarding mall my my ID was one the map was one the expedition it was um, I'm just gonna leave it like this the Y position goes right here just erase this and put anything well no don't put anything put what you got in the in the dot GPS command okay well yeah just edit it and save it X out of it and save it and now I'll put it in your scripts folder if you don't have a scripts folder then you're probably gonna have to make a new one and just put it in there and yeah that's pretty much it just restart your server oh and also the NPC um, probably every time you restart the server you're gonna have to go to the teleport NPC and do this command to it make sure you select it do the dot NPC flags no dot NPC space flags space one do that to the teleporter to the NPC that you made and the teleport script should start working okay well yeah that's pretty much it I hope it works for all you guys it worked for me pretty good and it was an awesome teleporter I can't really show you right now because um, my computer will lag a lot and it will probably shut down huh? okay well bye and thanks for watching remember to comment rate and subscribe